Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Queen. So today I'm doing the Rihanna Wild Thoughts inspired look, which I know is like blowing up YouTube and the makeup community right now. But hey, I wanted to do it myself as well. So right now we're just going to go in with the Marc Jacobs Whirlpool Crayon Pencil. And this is what I'm using for the base of my eyes. So I don't actually have primer on right now. I'm just using that. And then I'm just going to blend it out into the crease, which is what you see here. So I'm just using the BH Cosmetics in the, I think it's a neutral palette that I have. I'm just going to kind of use that on top of the Whirlpool teal color as my transition and kind of darken up the crease a little bit with my MAC blending brush. And I think I put a little too much on one side, so I'm just going to blend it out. <laughs> Now going into some real fun, I'm actually using the Urban Decay Electric Palette in the color Fringe. And I'm just going to put it on top of the green teal Whirlpool base that I have going on right now. To really deepen it up and make it really pop. So I'm just using a flat uh, eyeshadow brush that I picked up from Target a few years ago. And I'm just going to keep blending that oil in. I'm kind of just patting it in, actually. I'm not really even, like, blending it in at the moment. I'm mostly just patting it and getting that color to really define itself. So off camera, I kind of sharpen up the edges. And I'm just using my Clinique palette that I've had for years, hunty, years. And I'm just going to go ahead and deepen the crease. Going back into Electric Palette, I'm using the Chaos Blue. And I'm using them in the corners of my eyes. So that way it will deepen up and it looks more put together. So I'm just going to keep blending out with my back. With my, uh, with my MAC brush. <laughs> and I'm just going to keep blending it out all together. You guys, I look rough. I don't know what is going on with me this day, but I look freaking rough. So back with the Clinique palette. I'm just going to actually use the white shimmery uh, color they have there and just kind of brighten up my inner corners. And that's what I do on both sides. To make this look a little bit more dramatic, I'm actually going back in with, I believe it was fringe, I said. Yeah, with fringe, and I'm going to go underneath the eye and to where my waterline is, and I'm just going to kind of bring out the color and bring out the dramaticness. Yes. I look like I've been crying, y'all. Like, look at my face. I seriously have like been crying or something. I swear I haven't. I don't know why I look so serious. <laughs> oh my god. So I just went ahead and did the rest of my full face off camera because that was kind of boring and we've all seen me do it a few times already. I'm just using the NARS Outlaw Blush and just kind of patting it on my cheeks. So I was just highlighting with the Anastasia palette, the contouring one, and then just using the MAC Ruby Rue lipstick that I love so much. I don't know why I cut myself off on the camera, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> but anyway, I'm just going to go ahead and then use a flat, like, lipstick brush. I'm not sure what they're called. I'm just kind of defining the edges out on the lipstick so it doesn't look so smudged out. And that is the final look, you guys. I hope you really enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Peace!